Today, I'd like to teach you how to find the molar mass of potassium iodide. And in order to do so, I've created a nice little table. Bam, so the first thing I'm gonna do is write the elements I see in the compound. So we have potassium and we have iodine. Next is then to identify the number of atoms, and that's where the subscripts come into play. If you don't see any subscripts, assume that there is a one there. Then we're gonna take those number of atoms and multiply by the mass of each element. That's where the periodic table comes in. So let's take a look. So here's the mass of potassium, 39.1. Mass of iodine is 126.9, so let's write them on down. So we got one, uh, 39, 39.10, and then we have 126.90. Then we're going to find the total mass of the elements, so we multiply this row on across to find that. So this is going to be 39, 39.10, and then iodine is going to be 126.90. And then to find the total mass of the entire compound, we just simply add up this column together. Easy peasy, right? So this is 166, basically gram per mole because we're finding molar mass. That's all there is to it. Thanks so much for tuning in. I look forward to helping you with more videos. Take care.